Hello everybody, today we have the following objectives. Okay, to create one document with the following specifications. Page 1 will be the cover page with 1 inch on all sides. Part 2 will be the questionnaire with 3 pages. Page numbers 1 to 3. Margin of 0 0.5 on all sides. Header which has questionnaire for exam on the left and a header with page numbers on the right third part will be an answer sheet with two pages page one and two margin with one inch on top and 0 0.5 on the other sides okay and then a footer with which says answer sheets on the left and then page numbers on the right today we are going to learn about page breaks page numbers footers, headers, in Microsoft Office. To start off, we are going to run Microsoft Word. So let's click on the start button and then run Microsoft Word 2010. Once Microsoft Word is opened, let's make this larger. We're going to type the cover page here. And then let's try to increase the size. Okay, so we're done with page 1. Let's just try to make sure that the margin are 1 inch on all sides. Okay, let's go to our second page. Now our second page will be the questionnaire. It has to have three pages with page numbers one to three. So we we'll label it with questionnaire. Okay. But it should have 0 0.5 on all sides. For us to change the format, we have to go to page layout and then breaks and then next page. This will make the, our new page have a different format. So let's put narrow there. It's 0 0.5 on all sides, which does not affect the first page. Let's go back to our notes. Okay, the header should say questionnaire for exam on the left. So let's insert a header. Click insert and then header. Okay, I will pick blank with three columns. It's much easier if you have this because you have three different parts where you can fill out. Okay, again, let's put here questionnaire for exam. Um, the second part, you can delete that. We don't need that. And then on the next part, we'll just put page number okay here as you can see it says page 2 on our cover page it also has the header so what we're going to do here is we're going to click on the header and then click on unlink this will not link the first page to the second page okay so here we have page 1 let's just delete that okay so here, it still says page 2, so we need to restart the page number here. So right click, format page numbers, and then we're going to start at 1. Okay, so again, our questionnaire has 3 pages, so let's make 3 pages. That's page 2, and then page 3. Okay, let's go back to our notes. Okay, here we have page 4. That should not be there, so we'll change that later. So, let's put answer sheets. Let me just look at the notes here. Our margin will be 1 inch on top and then 0 0.5 on all sides. So, let's try to make another page break. Page layout and then breaks. Next page. Okay, our margin should be 
1 inch on top and then the rest will be 0 0.5. Okay, the format is not affecting the previous page. However, there should be no header. So let's delete that uh, clicking on and link to previous so we can delete that now. Okay, so let's add a footer. Let's okay, the footer should say answer sheets for exam. So let's go back to our footer, insert, and then footer here. Again, blank with three columns. Now take note, the footer has been all already linked to the previous page. So let's try to type here first. Uh, no, let's unlink it. Okay, so what I can do is just delete the footer on the other pages and then all the other previous pages will not be linked so let's go back to the last page answer sheets okay it should have a footer so let's go down and then on the first column let's type answer sheets for example Okay, click and then type answer sheets for exam. Okay, let's put the page number here. Okay. Next, we're going to delete the middle part. Okay, our answer sheet should be two pages. So there, I think we already completed our task for today. It's creating one document with different margins, okay, and, and headers and footers using the page break. So if you learned something today, please like this video. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel, Comics and More. Thank you for watching.